The South Carolina Gamecocks return home today to Stone Stadium for the last time this season. They're playing ODU, a team who just took a loss at the hands of Florida International. Meanwhile, the Gamecocks recently tied against UNC Charlotte and need to win to stay alive in CUSA playoff hopes. Before the game, the team honored its five seniors as it would be their final time playing for the home crowd. ODU came out of the gate strong, and within the first two minutes, junior Nico Kolsterhofen put the ball top shelf past USC keeper William Pyle. Pyle would be key for the Gamecocks in this game, and he ended up with four saves on the day. However, he wouldn't be able to prevent that score and this one off of the penalty kick by Sebastian Hooray, putting the Monarchs up 2 to nothing. The Gamecocks offense, on the other hand, couldn't get anything going to start the game. But finally, in the 42nd minute, Carolina scored, with Luca Meyer getting a penalty kick opportunity of his own. This set up the Gamecocks with momentum going into the locker room, but they weren't done yet. The defense was able to set up freshman Benjamin Gilligan with a floater over the head of the ODU goalie, Akar Merchkan, to tie up the score by halftime at two apiece. Defense controlled the second half between the excellent play, offensive miscues, and the penalties, the scoring was stalled. This stalemate would be ended in the 82nd minute, however, with Justin Sukow putting the Gamecocks on top off the assist from Luca Meyer and Aiden O'Brien. The Monarchs would then go into attack mode with only 8 minutes left in the game. However, they only managed to pad pile save stats, and the Carolina Gamecocks would defeat Old Dominion 2-3. This win for the Gamecocks keeps their CUSA playoff hopes alive. Now they look forward to Friday where they play at UAB at 7, win and in. For Capital City Sports, I'm Ethan Still.